today I want to prepare a fast melon soup here is my melon right away I'll be placing the pots on the heat then I will be adding my palm oil you add it according to the quantity of your melon leave it to heat for like one minute after which you come and add your melon which is a goosey you just add it to the oil then after adding you just stir you stir kind of you are frying the melon hmm? you stir yeah so this is enough if not the melon will over fry so at this point i want i want to be adding pepper you add your pepper add your pepper then after adding your pepper you stir this is a maria goosey of god then now you have to add the meat that is cow beef and the kidney you add you stir you add your cow leg you add your cow leg and also you stir at this point i want to be adding the fish i won't be adding this the stock from the fish because i already have enough stock added to the soup then you have to carefully stir <laughs> i'm not cooking big soup today okay? first time in life so just because i have these small small things around i said let me use it to cook the soup so um at this point when you gradually uh, carefully stir because of the fish you'll be adding your bitter leaf add your bitter leaf so after adding your bitter leaf you have to add your crayfish add another crayf full spoon of crayfish then you at this point you bring up the heat to the medium and cover to continue cooking you cover to continue cooking let's check on our soup okay yes uh, it's doing well you 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 carefully stay stay mm -hmm. at this point bring down the heat so that your soup will not get burnt hey ooh days ooh days our melon soup is looking pretty yes uh, tray tray tracy kitchen is full of fun so as to this you can use it to eat any swallow of your choice pounded yam eba semu santana popularly known as santana abu so guys our melon soup is looking good so let me see if there is need for salt because i didn't add salt i didn't add seasoning because the stock i added has mm. the only thing is i don't know if i should leave it a bit at this point i can see that the soup is very thick let me add um let me add this uh stock from the fish just add it and leave it to cook for another three minutes because the soup is too thick so we need to add a bit so we we cover it again to continue cooking for another three minutes then by then our soup should be ready it's looking so pretty guys hey this is a goosey final so you cover lastly our melon soup is ready so you just stir and put off the heat you see guys this is looking so 
pretty yummy yummy any swallow of your choice is calling this melon soup any swallow you so wish mm? Apu pande biam eba e agidi any any swallow. Mm? It's just that melon is one of the soup I, I don't crave for. I don't crave for melon. But if you want to eat it, I can cook it for you. <laughs> so guys, our melon soup is ready, ready, good to save. Mm? Mm -hmm. Okay, guys, you see, small oil. Oh yeah. You see, so at this point, I think we have to call it a beautiful day. You see, once you see your oil floating, you know your soup is good to go. Mm -hmm. You all saw the oil from the beginning, the oil I used is not much. So, time to transfer it to my fridge container that is it that is all about our melon and goosey soup for today all right guys bye bye yo. love you all any swallow of your choice is calling this soup calling this soup because me, I know the shop melon. <laughs> I don't just like melon. But I love cooking. 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 Alright guys. Bye bye.